All those stories and more straight ahead. First, we want to bring you the very latest on Hurricane Lee. The storm intensifying to a dangerous Category 5 late last night. So we just got the 5 a.m. advisory into our newsroom. Let's turn it right over to Jennifer Correa with a brand new track. Jen? All right, good morning, and we are still tracking Hurricane Lee, and let me tell you, we're going to be tracking Lee for quite some time, but forecast track has been pretty consistent. Now, one thing that is new with this update is the fact that the maximum sustained winds have increased from 160 to now 165, so this is absolutely a dangerous Category 5 hurricane, which is still moving over the open waters of the Atlantic, but it is around 630 miles east of of the northeastern leeward islands. So yes, the approach itself is getting closer and closer to the Caribbean, but Lee will remain to the north of the Caribbean, not making a direct impact. Of course, with such a strong, powerful storm though, those impacts spread out, especially those large swells that are gonna start to impact the leeward islands later today and through the weekend through Puerto Rico, Hispaniola, and even the Turks and Caicos. We're talking about not just large swells, but dangerous recurrence for uh, all the beaches in these islands. Now that category five will eventually downgrade to a four. We could see that by Monday, but still uh, it is a powerful storm. Now let's talk about that turn towards the north. You're going to see it on the spaghetti plot, but I'm going to stop it right here at the end of the five day code that I just showed you. So that's Tuesday. You're probably asking yourself, I don't see that turn yet in the forecast code. Don't worry, you will. Because it's five days out, the forecast cone and the turn is a little later than that, probably happening around Wednesday morning. We don't see it just yet, but that's what we're going to be looking for on that forecast cone going through the weekend. But look at all these models in agreement that Lee will turn northward, staying east of the Bahamas.